advice today. The anti-violence message is what they were pitching to local high school students. And we also hear they had a very special guest. Our Scott Murray is here with more. Hi, Scott. I'll tell you what, the special guest you're referring to sang the national anthem at the ballpark in Arlington last night. And even though the Rangers came up short against the Yankees, this woman, well, she knows what it's like to be a big winner. As she visited schools today with members of the Texas Rangers, sharing the message to put an end to violence. Susan Jeske knows firsthand about violence. She's a resident of Littleton, Colorado, but now she's traveling around the entire country using her platform as Ms. America to help put an end to violence. Terry Briggs has our story. The Rangers' Dick Bosman and Jeff Zimmerman have seen plenty of pitches in their lives, but none like the one they saw at Southwest High School Tuesday. Uh -huh. It was very, very emotional. I mean, you know, Susan just did a great job. She's just so passionate for the cause, and you know, just, just listening to her, her talk, you know, just, just brought chills down my spine, you know, just this being the anniversary of um, what happened at Columbine last year. Where I grew up, it was the last place on earth a violent act like Columbine High School could possibly happen. But in reality, I am from Littleton, Colorado, where 12 students and one teacher were violently murdered. Susan Jeske is the reigning Ms. America, and her pitch is simple. Stop violence in our schools. I could tell you my nieces and nephews are definitely not the same. I don't know. Do you think you guys are still the same because you've gone through this? And she also knows that the Wedgwood Baptist Church tragedy hit home at Southwest High. And I feel very honored that Southwest High School was even interested in me coming to their high school. I, I didn't feel that I was really qualified. Not only was she qualified, she was inspiring, helping the kids make a pledge that everyone hopes they'll live by. What do you think? I think students like the sensitivity to our diverse population. I mean, look at the audience. There's a lot of people with different backgrounds and stuff. I mean, you need to respect the changes in that and learn to like them. They responded so well to it, and you know, Mrs. America, Susan Jeske did a marvelous job of bringing that out. I just hope that uh, I'm able, if I'm able to even make a difference in one person's life, I feel like I've done something really great. Believe me, she did great today. Terry Briggs, NBC5, Fort Worth.